The fucking Empire State of you. What time do you call this? Well, stick it to your timetable then, will we? I'm not paying you, so you can saunter There's in Here's the opera part of that sentence, Chief. You're hardly paying me at all. <laughs> you all right? Yeah, why? You're like sweating a lot. I was just trying hard not to be late. Yeah, we'll try harder the next time. You're looking after them London DJs tomorrow. What? Find one of them abandoned spots they can't fucking wreck. And bring them and their two live crew back there for a session. Get them whatever they want. Except glue. Glue? What are they? Bally firm of 15 year olds from the 80s? Can I play Womp? <laughs> 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 no. Scarlet for you. Anyway, there'll be no CDJs for you to play. Your man only plays vinyl. I can play vinyl. When you play. Which is very fucking rare. So let me play tomorrow. Look after them London heads and I'll try and get you a slot of this rave on Sunday. Only don't be shit. I love the way you just assume I'm gonna be shit. In fairness, you have been known to get mashed even before you get the first tune on. I have a reputation to uphold. I mean, I didn't buy this place and build it up for nothing just for you to fuck it up. You fucking liar. You told me you took this off your granddad. Yeah, well, he put his blood, sweat and tears into buying this place. He said it was a butcher shop that he inherited of someone who was English. No, no, I said it was a hardware shop and that he took it from the British. What, like, did he find the War of Independence? No, 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 no. He was a, a rat for the British Army. Got a few of Collins's men killed, and then he took this place as a reward from the Brits. Don't go telling too many people about that. That's nothing. My grand-uncle was one of the priests that ran all the Jews out of Limerick in the 30s. 